Hey YouTube, my name is Chris Tubbs, and I have the most recent version of the Minecraft Snapshot, which includes the Piston Extension Time update to it. And once I learned about this, I was pretty upset considering all the work and effort that I had been putting into um, hooking up this 4x4 door for this new multiplayer map that my friend Ben Kernow Design runs. So I sought out to try and fix it. Now, currently it's very easy to fix the the one that's uh, facing east to west this way, and you enter north to south. Very easy to fix it. First thing that you're going to want to do is just make sure that you watch uh, CMB's tutorial on, on how to fix it and make sure that you've got it the way that he shows you how to fix it with uh, replacing the torch here or moving a couple blocks here same thing on the other side as well as removing these blocks and repeaters here and changing the time there that's the first thing that you want to do and the most key thing that's different here is the is the uh, monostable one tick uh, creator which uh, is basically right here uh, this used to be on this timing setting, but uh, with the update and the time that it takes to, for pistons to extend, it doesn't send the one tick pulse through, which doesn't allow this block to spit out and act as a T flip flop. It just extends and comes back in. So you need to change this to one tick, and then this block will spit out like normal and act like a T flip flop. So that's one of the big things um, in the new update that you need to change. Now, as you can see with the way that this is oriented, oh, if you want to see my inventory, as you can tell, uh, I'm not sure if there's anywhere else to see the version. I guess I could exit to the main menu, but I show you this is the newest version I could find. Um, so, as you can see with this orientation and CMB's fix plus the fix I talked about, it closes perfect. And opens perfect. Now, here's where we run into some problems. Facing in the other direction, everything's still being fixed. Uh, this here was me trying to just make sure where that monostable pulse was coming from, which I was pretty sure it came from there, but oops. Just wanted to make sure by hooking up a piston to it. So this is shooting out a monostable pulse. Oh, I guess I could show you guys that, but that's fixed over here. It's easy to basically show. You hit the button. There you go. Monostable pulse. Big thing is the monostable pulse is not getting sent to these pistons. Uh, they're getting sent to these ones, but I don't see where the timing difference is. If you watch this is where the monostable pulse comes from, you follow it this way, that's one tick of delay. It comes up through here, basically inverts this torch, inverts this line of power, and inverts that torch and spits those ones out. Now that one works fine. Uh, now this side, running into a little bit more problems there and I'm really not sure why. Um, same thing on this side. Same exact thing. And um, I, I just don't understand it. So uh, what we're going to do is film that one working, film this one failing, Slow them down, put them next to each other, and hopefully we'll be able to see where the differences are and hopefully be able to come to a conclusion to be able to fix both of these. And hopefully, by the time we do that, it'll be just like CMB's fix where it doesn't matter which way you orient this setup, it will work regardless north to south, east to west. So stay tuned for that. Alright, so pay close attention to this part. I'm going to play the same footage three times in a row, slow down. The left side is the broken 4x4 door, and the right side is the working 4x4 door. The left side, the opening where you walk through, faces east to west. The right side where you walk through, faces north to south. So keep that in mind when watching the footage. Thanks.